Well, when I came to work, I was wondering where the snow was. I guess I know now, Kevin. You know now, right? Into the afternoon over central North Dakota. Dickinson, we're done with the accumulation. Maybe a light dusting, but we can even make out, uh, maybe on your TV, you can see a little bit of sun here. So we're losing uh, some of the higher returns of snow in western North Dakota. The system's exiting now. I don't expect any more accumulation in the Queen City or the western third of the state here. 19 right now in Dickinson. North wind at 9 miles per hour. Watford City, about 4 inches of snow. 3 in Dickinson and Regent area reports between about two and four inches of snow just now coming down in the Bismarck Mandan area over the past hour or so. And again, beginning to let up here over Western North Dakota is ending here. Didn't see much snow in the KUMB viewing area whatsoever. Only a few flurries and the snow here over South Central North Dakota, including our KFR viewing area. This will last for a few hours into the mid to maybe even late evening time frame. This will begin to shift farther to the east as well. Heaviest snow though is going to end up between Aberdeen, Jamestown, Valley City, and Fargo, Wapaton area. Even heavier snow, I think, destined for the Wapaton and Fargo area up I-29 here the next several hours, eventually making its way toward Grand Forks. And again, near Williston, we've had no snow here for today. Just a few flurries, but no accumulation. Why not? You're not looking for any snow accumulation as well. We can see on the radar returns here, nothing more than a few flurries expected, but accumulation uh, likely along and east of US-83 into the night here. St uh, still snowing a little bit toward Dickinson, but again, starting to decrease. 19 in the Queen City, 20 in Bismarck, Devils Lake and Jamestown, 20 degrees. 31, though, in Fargo. The wind overall between about 10 and 20 miles per hour. We don't have a lot of significant wind, so there's a minor uh, blowing snow potential, so that's a possibility, but again, not the wind that we've had so much of uh, the past couple of weeks with this system moving on through. Up to the minute, additional snow forecast. This is not taken into consideration what has already fallen here. Again, little of any snow expected for Dickinson. Might see a little bit in Williston later tonight. Uh, we'll see some flurries increase and maybe a few snow showers. That's why that's showing up there. But for the Bismarck Mandan area, maybe one or two inches. Jamestown, darker blue shade, four inches. And I think upwards of six inches possible for Grand Forks and for the uh, Fargo area. Jamestown, three to five inches. Bismarck total here about one to two and just trace amounts of additional snow uh, for Dickinson, Minot, and Will. Williston as the system continues to advance off toward the east. Let me put this in motion here. And again, we can see that snow, but still some snow showers back farther toward the northwest uh, being reintroduced into the area after midnight. And that may continue into the morning time frame. So this might give us a dusting over the northern reaches of the state. Otherwise, the flurries gradually end. The clouds will clear out and we'll see a little bit of sunshine with temperatures likely in the 20s here for our Wednesday afternoon. So again, don't look for a lot of additional snow. The western half of North Dakota. The snow ending everywhere overnight from west to east here, and we're looking at temperatures to remain well below normal. Normally low to mid 40s. We won't see 40s for a long time, not until April sometime. Chances for more light snow, but nothing too major for the weekend. All right. Thanks a lot. You're welcome.